Question 1. What is the normal duration of the first stage of labor in a prime gravita? Correct option C, 12 to 20 hours. Question 2. The first stage of labor ends with Correct option B, complete dilation of cervix. Question 3. The normal fetal heart rate, FHR, is? Correct option B, 100 to 160 BPM. Question 4. The hormone responsible for uterine contractions is? Correct option C, oxytocin. Question 5. The most favorable pelvic type for vaginal delivery is? Correct option C, gynecoid. Question 6. Which sign is indicative of true labor? Correct option D, progressive cervical dilation. Question 7. What is the average blood loss during normal vaginal delivery? Correct option C, 500 milliliters. Question 8. The third stage of labor is concerned with Correct option C, delivery of the placenta. Question 9, a prolonged labor lasts more than. Correct option B, 18 hours. Question 10, the best indicator of fetal well-being during labor is. Correct option D, fetal heart rate pattern. Question 11. The Bishop score is used to assess. Correct option C, cervical redness for labor. Question 12. A sudden gush of fluid from the vagina indicates. Correct option B, rupture of membranes. Question 13. The normal duration of the second stage of labor in a prima gravita is? Correct option C, one to two hours. Question 14. Which medication is commonly used to induce labor? Correct option B, oxytocin. Question 15. A 10 centimeter cervical dilation is termed as. Correct option B, full dilation. Question 16. What is the normal pH of amniotic fluid? Correct option C, 7.0 to 7.5. Question 17. Which sign indicates the placenta has been expelled completely? Correct option A, firm uterus. Question 18. What fetal position is ideal for vaginal birth?
Correct option C, occiput anterior. Question 19. What medication is given to control postpartum hemorrhage? Correct option D, diazepam. Question 20. What is the normal range for cervical effacement? Correct option B, 0 to 100%.